welcome to the PC Michigan Tech Help Show. I'm your host, Craig Chamberlain, and today in the Faster 7 series, I'm going to show how to use show you how to utilize a USB stick you might have lying around that has ready boost capabilities. Now, this is a great tip for those of you who have low memory systems. Um, it does show a performance increase on both your uh, processor speed and your startup time. Now, for those of you who have higher memory systems, we're talking like two gigabytes plus, you probably won't even see much of a difference with this, and you can go ahead and you know, step onto the next tip. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to your desktop and in the upper left hand corner uh, just double click on computer. Obviously at this point you've plugged in your USB device and it's able to be opened. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to that particular device. In my case it's the H drive and we're going to right click on it and we're going to scroll down to the property section and select that. Now once that comes up we have the uh, tab up here at the top called Ready Boost. So go ahead and select that. Now my device actually does not support Ready Boost. It's the only one I had lying around. I thought I'd try it out. It is a 16 gigabyte. It's actually my phone. I, I was actually thinking it'd be kind of cool if I could use my phone. Unfortunately, my phone does not support it. Either that or my USB drives don't uh, devices don't support it. So give it a try. Just plug it in and see if it works. Now at this point you're going to get a slider down here and you'll be able to slide from left to right how much data on your USB device you want to use for this ReadyBoost. Now ReadyBoost stores data temporarily on a USB device that is non-critical data. So you can still pull out the USB device if you need to. It's not going to all of a sudden cause your computer to crash or anything. Now this should, like I said, shave off some, shade off, shave off some startup time. and. Um, it is a great tip for uh, those of you who have a USB drive lying around and a couple extra spare USB ports. So give it a shot and uh, hopefully it works for you. If it doesn't, just move on to the next tip. Or if you have a high uh, memory system, move on to the next tip. I would not go out and purchase a Ready Boost Ready uh, USB device just because you know you want to try this tip. It's not going to give you like a 15 to 20 dollar increase uh, in speed, but it does give you an increase. So that's what this series is all about. So thanks for stopping by. As always, uh, thumbs up if you liked it, and uh, stay tuned, and there'll be more videos to come.